thought the Cavs took a step forward in their game Sunday night, the double overtime win against Indiana. Not that they played a great game, but they played a determined game. They played a bit of an angry game. You know, some people are making out uh, a lot about LeBron James yelling at Tristan Thompson, Tristan Thompson yelling back at him, and they're arguing about defense or whatever. To me, fine. It showed some passion, some spark. These guys have been playing in a coma almost for over a month. So I look at this, you know, the month of March, the Cavs were seven and 10. It was the first time LeBron James, any LeBron James team had lost 10 or more games since his rookie year, November of 2003 to be exact. And you could just see how they were so passive. You know, in that game against Indiana, Indiana's playing for his playoff life. Cavs may see Indiana in the first round. It was a game where there was a lot of pushing and shoving. It was a very physical game. The officials let a lot go. It, it really did feel to me like a playoff game. It was a game where guys were getting tired and missing easy shots. And so not only did they play with determination, and yeah, some anger, and yeah, maybe uh, right now Tristan Thompson and LeBron James, even though they have the same agent and are close or a little uh, uh, unsure of each other, I'm sure they'll work it out. At the end of that game, they remember they had Kevin Love on the team. And they began to go to Kevin Love in that second overtime. And it just showed, you know, Love could hit some jump shot, a hook shot. He played well. J.R. Smith in that game came alive, hit some outside shots. So I'm encouraged, finally, with many of the other videos and many of my other stories, while well, you've been very down. This is the first sign of real good life for me about the Cavs as they head into the playoffs.